Hey, Cheryl Lazar coming to you from VidCon with Kyle and Mitchell. How's it going? Great. It's going good. Are you having fun? Yes. Look at my hands. I know. Those are the fun hands. Fun hands. Ah. And you guys did a whole speech, which is a bit different because you're used to right, creating videos, doing a speech, videos, different things. It wasn't exactly a speech. It was more just us talking. That, yeah. That's a better... Yeah, it was like a video without the editing. Yeah. So I'm, I'm down with it. It was like a three-star video. Yeah. <laughs> It's like a thumbs down video. Yeah, thumbs down, <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah. So what did you share? What, any, uh, you know, stories or... Uh, yeah, like a whole theme we went with is just like we actually tried to talk about VidCon and I just keep interrupting with random thoughts. Nice. <laughs> what do you guys think about VidCon? It is amazing. This is probably the best. Someone just did this to me. No, yeah, it's probably awesome. It, it, no, not probably. What am I saying? It has been awesome. This has been a fantastic thing and it's like a gathering plus, which is something I've been waiting for for a long time. Yeah, what is it like to meet all these people in real life? It's amazing. It's one of the best times of my life. Like, I've, I was so excited to meet people I've seen in videos or, like, people come up and say, I've tweeted you or something like that. I was like, I remember. It's so cool. Like, it's, like, surreal. <laughs> we're, we're, like, in the twilight zone. And everyone's so much taller than I thought they would be. So I'm, I'm just walking around like, wow, you're not in a box. You're just, you're really high. You're tall. It's, it's, so it's, it's kind of nuts. So what is your story? How did you both get started? Um, we, uh, we met at a birthday party when we were like 10 and we just became really good friends and we realized that we would get out of doing work in school by um, telling stories in class. And so one day we were like, maybe we should make videos of this. And um, it just kind of spurted from there, it just went off and off and off and then and now we're here still telling stories that we think are funny. Yeah, wonderful, <laughs> wonderful little stories. It's all about a story. It's all about a story. Beginning, middle, end. What was the first video that really you're like we're on to something? Um, when he went away for when you moved away for a little bit, there was a time where it was just me. Um, I made a e card that you could send said you're awesome slash, which was the idea of like telling someone you're awesome, but then you get to be like oh also you're fired. I'm sorry, and uh, it ended up being the first video to break a million, and I think it's kind of what brought people in sometimes. Mm -hmm. So I'm asking this to everyone: How do you keep it going after you get that one video? We just love what we do. Yeah, we do it when we're not like making videos. We just yeah, we are we are us. Like there's no characters. We just decided. Yeah. Well, you know what? Let's show how weird and normal we are. And maybe all those people that are the same will watch these and go, Hey, you know what? I'm like that too. And maybe it's just funny. I can I can do this. You still go to school? Uh, we we both did go to school for a while, and then YouTube became like way more of our job. But we both plan on going back to school yeah. as soon as we get the time. How old are you? We're about 20. Okay. Yeah. What do your parents think of it? Um, my grandma is extremely supportive of it all. She was just, yeah, she was just, she was just like, finally, this, this feels like that thing you've always wanted to do, which is just making people happy and it's art related. And uh, yeah, she was just ecstatic. So it's just it. My parents loved it. I mean, at first they were like a little skeptical. They're like, you're not going to school anymore? Like, what are you going to do? But um, I told them and, I, you know, they know this is what I love, like Mitchell said. And um, so they are very supportive of it, everything I do. There was never that talk like, no. <laughs> they, just, they just, they both enjoy it. It's awesome. So what do you say to all these people out there that want to do what you're doing? Or like, what does the future hold for this? Uh, really, I get, the thing I say is make videos and, and, and do whatever you really, truly love. Don't, don't try to recreate anything. I mean, take bits from everything and then mold it and become your own thing. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's the stuff that people like to watch is that, that genuine you. Yeah. It's attractive, like I keep yeah, saying. You keep saying it as a joke. It's so attractive. That's an interesting comparison. It's attractive. Yeah, but that's it. You, but <laughs> you in your PJs is attractive. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's, if that's you. If that's you, if, that's you, if you want to be the PJ blogger, like, then the go for it. PJ blogger. Where's this all going, though? Uh, wherever. I, yeah, I, don't, I wish I could tell you. Cardigan. Yeah. Oh, oh, the cardigan? Yeah. Keep, I'm keeping it classy. Um, no, it, it's that's the fun thing about YouTube is there's no book saying what we have to do next. Uh, I mean, right now we're uh, taking singing lessons and guitar lessons. So mm -hmm. hopefully in the future there is some music coming from Live Lava Live. And uh, we also, we write a lot. Maybe there could be a book. I mean, it's just fantastic to know that this new media outlet is really just awesome. Well, congratulations. Have fun. Thank you. You too. You too. You too. You too.